this uh, most pleasant evening. There has been a clamour to get inside the... Ukraine have gone with a 4-5-1, Jim. Well, most teams that use this system, Peter, will work it in a, a way where, yes, they'll have a 4-5-1 shape off the ball and ideally a 4-3-3 shape on it. We often see that 4-1-4-1 shape too, and that has an obvious flexibility about it. It's a, it's a popular managerial selection because of that. It's just extremely flexible with all the numbers I've mentioned. There's the whistle. Jim, which player is best equipped for this game? Yeah, Cristiano Ronaldo. I don't think there's any doubt he's one of the best around, Peter. Probably one of the best ever. He's an incredible physical specimen and a phenomenal goal scorer. You can't question his commitment and determination either. He's always in peak condition and he'll adapt his game to whatever role is requested of him. I think he's going to have a huge, huge impact on this team. Yeah, he'll be looking for a goal or two. And it's Konoplyanka. Has a pop! Oh, managed to get it away. That's just very well played. He can't hurt you with his back to goal. And he didn't go for the back heel. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Ruben Diaz. Just to point out, Peter, that the fullbacks are quite high. And what do they try to achieve? Well, it's obviously a move to push um, the opposition wide men back and, and give them more to think about. Zinchenko. Zinchenko. He's got away. A oh, well played. He's taken that really cleanly. That intervention was very necessary. And here's Konoplyanka. Konoplyanka. And the finish! Oh, he did the hard part right, but fluffed the finish. It's easy to say it, but difficult to stop it when runs in behind her are being made like that. Ruben Diaz hoists it forward. Well, that's where he wants it. So it is still nil-nil. Battles to win it back. Semedo has it in a wide. Zinchenko. Bruno Fernandes gets it back. Brings it forward. Out to the right. Guerrero. Ruben Neves. towards half-time and it is still scoreless Bruno Fernandes Nelson Semedo finds himself eased off the ball he's left his man and the counter is on striding forward facing goal Bruno Fernandes dashing forward at pace and it's Bernardo Silva. William Carvalho. Bernardo Silva. He could be in here. He's had a shot. It's in. And grabbing that opening goal so close to half the psychological edge 
And once one of your main men that's doing the damage, it just grows the togetherness and it grows the spirit. With time and space are plenty, he was never going to... Striker's job is to find the space. And we hit half-time. And there we are, off they go for half-time. So, off we go once more. Ukraine don't need to press the panic button just yet. They may have to tweak their, their setup first if they don't grab an early goal in the second half. They can't hold back, though. That's offside. Sinchenko. Forward it goes. Oh, good interception. Konopienka. Ruben Neves. Guerrero. Ukraine get it back again. Pings it out wide. That's the sort of defending that is going to upset the opposition. It already has, actually. Well, he's the quarterback equivalent, so I'm not surprised that he's been closed down first. Koroplyanka. Ukraine, still this single goal behind. Well, it's good stuff. This is better. Well, hit and hope is just about the sum of it, isn't it, Jim? Spot on, Peter. Bruno Fernandes tries to get it forward quickly. So, Jim, what are you thinking? Well, they may be down, but they're far from out. In terms of chances, they're right up there with these opponents. Great strength on the ball. And it's played forward. William Carvalho. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. And it's Konoplyanka. It's a loose ball. Stepanenko. Nelson Semedo tries to get it forward quickly. Bernardo Silva. Bernardo Silva plays it forward. There's a real appetite from them to finally put this game to bed, but will they? William Carvalho. Forward it goes. Cristiano Ronaldo. Nelson Semedo. This is good ball retention, and it should be enough from here, but they want to double their advantage. Oh, real chance! Great challenge, time to perfection. Ukraine are actually displaying tremendous fighting spirit. There's a real belief that they can still have a say. Ruben Diaz drives it forward. Bruno Fernandes. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Portugal can afford to settle on seeing this one out by running down the clock, I think. they've perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front and they really commit forward and drill and that's that well, nobody is totally satisfied but it was a, a more than decent game a super watch and it ends in a draw
Your final thoughts, Jim? Ukraine certainly had some good moments, people.